Hey everyone, Troy here from the Sprint Product Ambassador team coming at you with the video of the LG V20 and the split screen and multi-view functionality. Uh, you can quickly switch between your applications on this device just like any other Android device but the power of Android Nougat or Android 7.0 makes things significantly easier for you um, and it's built in quite easily into the uh, LG V20 here. To access your multi-view, of course, you want to have had open applications, and I've already opened quite a few. You just want to touch the, the square in the lower right-hand corner. If, of course, you've changed the way that your tray looks, uh, your square could be anywhere down there. However, on mine, it's still in the lower right-hand corner, so we'll go ahead and tap that. And that pulls up all of your recent applications. And so from here, you can, you can do a couple of things. First, you can click the Clear All button in the top right-hand corner. And that'll clear out all of your applications, so remove them from your, your memory uh, and that sort of thing, so free up some memory for you to do things on your device. Uh, what you can also do from here is you can, you can designate certain applications by clicking this little thumbtack. And that allows you, as you can see at the bottom, it says app pinned will not be cleared. So when you clear all of your applications, those apps will stay open. So if maybe you had a web page open or, or something like that that you wanted to save, uh, then it wouldn't close down when you hit the clear all button. And then from here, you can also close out individual apps or you can just slide them. So you can either tap the X or you can slide them left and right. Uh, the other thing is, is the split screen functionality. And what you can do from here is you can, you can display two applications that are compatible with the split, split screen functionality. Uh, so that way you can use two apps at one time. And to do that, uh, just look for the applications that have an icon similar to that right there. And it has the, the split screen. Uh, if you tap the split screen icon, it'll, it'll allow you to choose up to two applications to have in the split screen view. Uh, certain apps, as you can see with the Starbucks and speed test application, those do not allow split screen, unfortunately. Uh, so you're going to find that some apps have that functionality built in, and then there's also some apps that do not. Uh, so your mileage may vary when it comes to the apps that you want to use. Uh, so for this example, I'll just go ahead and open up the, uh, we'll say apps and games, which is in the Google Play Store. Uh, we'll just tap that uh, split screen application icon. Uh, oddly enough, the video doesn't allow to pick up the split screen, so I'm going to have to pause and play here. But uh, once we've tapped that, it pu puts it up into the top. Uh, we'll go ahead and tap another one, which is going to be, we'll just go ahead and do Chrome here real fast. And there you go. So from here, you can see that you have two different applications open. If you want to change the application that you have open, just tap the split screen icon in the lower right hand corner. And then from there, you can choose a different application. So we'll actually just open up Twitter. And what you can see is you can you can then flip flop between the applications that you have. So maybe you have YouTube up and maybe you have text messaging open, something like that. Maybe you're watching a YouTube video while you're text messaging somebody. Um, and you can also drag the the window up and down so you can kind of expand which window you want to see more of and of course they're both fully functional you have all the options that you want in, in both both applications in the split screen view um, and then from here if you just want to get out of it you just scroll down to the bottom or you even scroll up to the top depending on which app that you want to use at that point um, one other neat trick that you can do in this uh, with the with the multi window button is you can quickly flip between two different applications that you've had open. So perhaps you have Google Play Store open, and you had Twitter open. Instead of you know instead of tapping the application icon or excuse me tapping the multi window button and then manually selecting the app, if you're just flip flopping between apps and and, and I do this a lot maybe between you know email and text messaging. Uh, or maybe a website and a text message if I'm putting in a security code or something like that. You can just quickly double tap the multi-window button and it'll rotate between your two most recently used applications. And of course, as you switch it, you'll see that when that happens, we'll pull up two different apps, of course. So that way you can see that when that happens and it loads up this weather bug app, the most recently used app from there, of course, was Twitter at that point, And it just flip flops between those two. Uh, so it's a very handy feature to have, especially when you're transcribing information, say, from a text message to an email or, or, or from a text message to a website or something along those lines. Uh, but those are your quick tips on how to use the multi-window and split-screen functionality on the LG V20. Uh, drop a comment below if you have any questions or concerns. Thank you.